Wow, that's a really nice tanker stash you got, bro. Thanks. Really appreciate that. I don't know if anybody noticed. You can't not notice that tanker stash. That's a nice tanker stash. I do not have a uh, oil tanker tour video, so let's do an oil tanker tour. Oil tanker tour video. Um, yeah, it's a uh, it's a relatively smaller ship uh, in comparison to other oil tankers. It's like an eco class um, tanker, and when I say small, it's like five six hundred feet. It's not tiny by any means, but in comparison, it's kind of small. Um, Nonetheless, let's do a tour. Uh, we're currently docked in LA right now, Long Beach. But yeah, start at the manifold, do a little lap around the deck, make our way back inside, and uh, yeah, all right. All right, here's the ship. Um, this is the bow, this is the stern, and right in the middle of the ship is the manifold. And that's where we're gonna start. From there, we'll head back to the stern, dick around a little bit, then shoot up to the bow, dick around a little bit, then go into the house. All right, let's go. All right, the starboard manifold. So the manifold's where we hook up shoreside to transfer the cargo. Look at this bosun. This guy's always working on something. And the paint locker. This is where we keep all the paint, if you can already figure that out. So the stern is one of our main mooring areas. Um, back here you can see we're using our inshore and our offshore lines. So the Suez room is for the Suez Canal, but as you can see, it's currently for boxes and apprentices. Pilot ladder, port gangway, passing the port manifold, the boson shop is where we keep all our deck maintenance stuff, but mainly we use it to hide from the cold. All right, the bow. Another major mooring area. We have our offshore lines. And our inshore lines.
and underneath the bow we have the fort soul. I miss sleep. I miss it so much. Anyway, uh, yeah, down here we have extra hoses, tools, lines, all the good stuff. All right, let's head back to the house. Big sexy crane. Okay, the laundry room. Instead of having floor cleaner as detergent, this ship actually has Tide Pods. Locker room. Uh, what's crazy about the locker room is there's a goddamn sauna in here. Yeah, this ship's all about that spa life. Um, every Wednesday, there's a sea turtle that comes and gives massages. Okay, the gym. Gym's actually really nice on this ship. A uh, lot of free weights, good equipment. Okay, A deck. Okay, we have the crew's lounge slash mess. Um, yeah, it's kind of nice watching TV while you eat. All right, the galley. These guys make one hell of a tuna fish sandwich. Ship's office, this is where the deck gang usually musters. The officer's mess, complete with a goddamn popcorn machine. What do you guys know about that fresh pop? Cargo control room, also known as a CCR. This is the, uh, the main area for when we're transferring cargo. Our third mate, hard at work. B deck. And C deck. Uh, these two decks just have everyone's staterooms. And the bridge, by far the coolest part of the ship. That's right, that's an espresso machine on the bridge. We're all about that coffee life. That's a good looking helm. Big shout out to the second mate for keeping the plants going. It's, uh, it's pretty nice seeing green stuff in the middle of the ocean. You gotta love the view from the bridge wing. And last but not least, the lifeboat. It's, uh, it's one of those free-falling lifeboats, so pull the lever and uh, enjoy the ride. That's it, tour of a tanker. Hope you, uh, hope you enjoyed it. I know I certainly did. <laughs> um, hopefully next time you guys see me, I won't have the tanker stash. That's how you'll know uh, that I won't be on the tanker anymore. I'll be a free man roaming around. Uh, yeah, I need to go to sleep. I'm freaking exhausted. See you guys next time.